know the difference in line. 22 sport bill, I don't know if you choose a 30 or a 50. Uh, what are you going to be doing with it? Put the kite. I'd go 50. Yeah. So the two reels have a 50 and a 50 wide. Uh, 50 wide's for the yummy, just because you have the extra line capacity. You're going to get yeah. like 900 yards, which is yeah. more than enough, obviously. Uh, dead flyer is just fine on the 30. Um, but if you want to fly a yummy, it'd be a 50 or 50 wide. Yeah. I got you. All right. That's a pre-made one. What is that, 11 on it, hook? Yeah, I think it's J-hook. J-hook, and then a, a 6 and a kaiju. Uh, and then I'm what pound to... liter is that? I Wind on is just like basically the top shot. It's just it's after the. It's a five feet that has a serve loop at the end, so you do a loop to loop connection, just so there's no knock. Oh, gotcha. Nice scratch, huh? Yeah. Once they all move into San Clemente, they just hang out there pretty much, all around. And then the banks out there, out by Tanner Banks and... You know how much line that put on it? 700 yards. 60 bucks, don't need helium. If it's 15 knots, you fly the Boston. This is way cheaper. Um, it's also a little easier to fly in a sense because you don't have to you know, tie the balloon and tape it and all this stuff. Yeah. But um, for kite, like square kites, what, like, uh, whether yeah. you typically get fishing? That's expensive. Man. They're super expensive. Yeah. And then so for balloon. Mm -hmm, um, yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. I mean, both are like necessary. Yeah, they are. Yeah, like, yeah they are. Yeah. 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 Sure. Yeah. 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 And that way, you don't need helium. Uh, it's literally just one swivel that you tie to, and it's like there's two lines you'll see going to the top edges, and there's no other connections. Mm -hmm. It's like the bag also sits behind it. And yeah. It flies well, but it's kind of hard to be like, get used to. Did you want, or are you going to pick up a flat fall? Okay. <laughs> yeah. 37 60, sir. You like it longer? Yeah, this one's a big tune. Yeah. Why is that? Yeah, but dude, those things are sport to get oh, to, to be able to get it around stuff on the boat, you're yeah, saying? That, that thing that just has going into the boat, and you got that little thing in the rod holder, dude, like, you're, you know, I think. 
too much tension I feel like pull the hook. Yeah, yeah. exactly. It's, it's <laughs> yeah. funky, and a lot of it doesn't make sense that it can hold, because I mean, it's just, it's like line pulled through itself a couple of times, yeah. and it doesn't, you hate to say it, but it doesn't look like it should work, but boy, it sure does. <laughs> Oh, is that how you do it? You sit on it? Yep. Oh, nice. Yeah. yeah. It's super common. I mean, it's a really comfortable spot to do it. You just kind of put it like, you kind of put it on the bottom side of your, of your thigh. Yeah. And you just kind of put the rod there and then your body weight literally just pushes down on you can, you can just squat down a little bit, which rocks the rod back, and then you just lift back up and turn the handle. So instead of doing, instead of doing this, <laughs> it works smarter, not harder, right? Thanks, guys. Take it easy. You too. All right, show time. <laughs> Got it. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Next up, Bluefin. Yep. Yeah, dude.